Cards Against Humanity can be considered quite offensive to those with more sensitive palates. Remember, you've been warned. Alright. Every step towards blank gets me a little closer to blank. Every card I play gets me a little closer to hell. <laughs> Pretty much. Hmm. Yes. That and yes to that. Okay. I will take that. You know, as much as I watch people play this online as well, and sit there and scream at my screen of like, hey, no, you should have picked that one. It would have been perfect. I can't wait to see if people do that for this video too. <laughs> like, no, no, you should have picked that. That would have been perfect. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Alright, every step towards blank gets me a little closer to blank. Every step towards a homemade cum stained Star Trek uniform gets me a little closer <laughs> to an uppercut. Every step towards tasteful side boob gets me a little closer to surprise sex. Or every step towards bling gets me a little closer to winning the approval of Cookie Mama that that you never got from actual mama. This one's really hard because one was really perfect up until the uppercut. Right, I mean... Yep. I don't know. I think you get the uppercut for that, so... <laughs> well, yeah. It, depends on where you show up. <laughs> I kind of like the idea, too, though. Yeah. I mean, but this is a tough one, though. Only comes to Star Trek anymore. Yeah, it's got to win. <laughs> yeah, I figured that was him. The side boob was very close. <laughs> Tasteful side boob. I like that one. That's why I picked it. Money can't buy me love, but it can buy me blank. <laughs> oh. I'm going to help. I, 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 I have a few that would have been good for this. All right, money can't buy me love, but it can buy me Republicans. Very true. <laughs> yep. <laughs> but it can buy me enormous Scandinavian women. Or, but it can buy me chainsaw for hands. <laughs> yeah. I like large, large women. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, Scandinavian, man, they're going to rock your world and break your hips. Hi, MTV. My name is Kendra. I live in Malibu. I'm into blank, and I love to have a good time. Well, what is this one? Hi, MTV. My name is Kendra, and I live in Malibu. I'm into masturbation, and I love to have a good time. I'm into child beauty pageants, and I love to have a good time. Or I'm into keg stands, and I love to have a good time. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that'll do it. Yeah, sometimes they are very easy picks. Well, let's look at it this way. It was obviously a female, so it's not as creepy as it could be. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so. Okay. I'm going to hell. <laughs> it lurks in the night. It hungers for flesh. The summer. No one is safe from that. No one is safe from men, the Holy Bible, or a reason not to commit suicide. <laughs> Did I fix the echo echoing? Uh, I think so, yeah. Let's see here. Oh, wait, I bet I know why he's echoing. Turn this down a bit. Okay. Basically. Uh. Or, a romantic candlelit dinner yeah. from, would be incomplete without. Romantic candlelit dinner would be incomplete without what? Oh. Hmm. Uh. Uh. uh Oh. 
Oh. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll just go with this one. It seems the less. Um, a snapping turtle biting the tip of your penis. <laughs> okay. Passive aggressive <laughs> post it notes and African children. I think I might know who put this one. <laughs> Ugh, I'm stealthy. I was wondering if Wildfire might have took out his snapping turtle. <laughs> right. He's out here right back, so. What's the crustiest? Mouth herpes. Eat in the hole of the cookies before the aid bake sale. Or fuck mountain. Oh, that one. I was actually told that. In his newest and most difficult stunt, David Blaine must escape from blank. Mm. Yep. In his the newest Jews. and most difficult stunt, David Blaine must escape from the Jews. <laughs> from In, wait, former President George W. Box? Okay. Or the light of a billion suns. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very kindly. Life for American Indians was forever changed when the white man introduced them to blank. Oh, shit. Where is that? I think I had a... Mine actually could be horrible, funny, and relevant. <laughs> Man, I've got a lot of potentially good cards. That must have been the last one that we had. Life for American Indians was forever changed when the white man introduced them to reverse cowgirl. The white man introduced them to too much cocaine, and when the white man introduced them to a windmill full of corpses. <laughs> oh, wow. I mean, you know. It's, uh, they did give smallpox blankets. Yeah, that's true. I was just trying to... Apparently, with my church, I was just trying to help the problem. Right. I just thought cocaine would be a good one. In the distant future, historians will agree that blank marked the beginning of America's decline. Oh. What a perfect last one, actually, but... Mmm. 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 Well, I mean, this is also... relevant. There's some of these I'm trying to save at that perfect moment, and then there's some that I would feel really bad playing. <clears throat> uh, you should have lost your more you years ago. You developed a conscience. <laughs> Only a slight, lo a slight one. Uh, we can no longer be friends with you. No. Oh. In the distant future, historians will agree that blank marked the beginning of America's decline. Vikings <clears throat> getting drive-by shot, or a nuanced critique. Yeah! Because <laughs> relevant. <laughs> That's right. Alright. But wait, there's more. If you order blank in the next 15 minutes, we'll throw in blank absolutely free. Hmm. I could add some that works for this. <laughs> Okay, but wait, there's more. If you order a subscription of men or a subscription to Men's Fitness, in the next 15 minutes, we'll throw in a really cool hat, <laughs> absolutely free. If you order Being John Malkovich, in the next 15 minutes, we'll throw in an interracial handshake <laughs> for free. <laughs> and if you order full frontal nudity <laughs> in the next 15 minutes, we'll throw in Viagra. Absolutely free. That's so hello. Yep, hello. <laughs> Perfect combination. Yep. Although I really like the idea of the really cool hat. 
<laughs> it's, it seems like something that a magazine would do. Like, buy this and we'll That's give right. you a That's hat. A real thing. That's a real thing right there. We'll give you this neat bowler hat. What? Uh, I knew I said pick shiny objects. Oh, shiny objects I might have actually chosen. <laughs> In his new self-produced album, Kanye West raps over the sounds of blank. <laughs> I, like wild, wild, wildfire. I like the fact that Wildfire heard in the chat says hell awaits me. In his new self-produced album, Kanye West raps over the sounds of preteens. And raps over the sounds of angel-headed hipsters burning for the ancient heavenly connection to the starry dynamo and the machinery of night. Or Kanye West raps over the sounds of bestiality. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I want to win the free team thing simply I'm, because of what's his name, R. Kelly. Oh yeah. Well, it didn't necessarily say there's anything sexual going on with that, but yeah, no, I get what you mean. Unfortunately, Neo, no one can be told what blank is. You have to see it for yourself. Hmm. Yep, we'll take that one. <laughs> Unfortunately, Neo, no one can be told what Jewish fraternity is. Is you have to see it for yourself. No one can be told what the female orgasm is. You have to see it for yourself. <laughs> and no one can tell you what Judge Judy is. You have to see it for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> oh god yeah <laughs> hardest choice for me so far he says this one is easily the female orgasm I think I don't know I mean Judge Judy it's... Yeah! I mean, I'm catching up. Alright, I'm sorry, Professor, but I couldn't complete my homework because of... Shit, I don't know the perfect one to use that, but I can't. We'll try this. That seems horrible. I haven't won one in a while. I need to get me a good card. I'm sorry, Professor, but I couldn't complete my homework because of being in a motherfucking box. <laughs> couldn't complete my homework because of brown people. And I couldn't complete my homework because of Grand Theft Auto, Grand Theft Auto Fort Lauderdale. Oh, this one's really hard. Mm-hmm. That's what she said. This is hard. This is a tough one. <laughs> I, I want to say one because I don't want to be that, you know. Right. I mean, one's a good one, too. It's it's funny and it's out there being a motherfucking box. <laughs> I'm already going to hell, so I'm Yay! I'm Aww. coming with you. <laughs> I thought I had a chance with Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> I mean, you know, having the worst day ever, hashtag blank. Oh, come on, see, that would have worked too. <sighs> that could have worked too, actually. Having the worst day ever, hashtag crying and shitting and eating spaghetti. <laughs> hashtag the Pope. And hashtag John oh, Abuse. Oh Two God. and three go together! <laughs> I don't know. I mean, you could do number one after it's all said and done. That's right. Oh, God, this is a tough one. Um, I mean, it would be a pretty horrible day crying and shitting and eating spaghetti, but the Pope and Joe would be... Oh. 
Yep. That one. Oh man, more I found caught up to me. All right. The Smithsonian Museum of Natural History has just opened an exhibit on blank. Mm hmm. Hmm. Oh, uh, mm. There's just one I don't want to use. The Sony Museum of Natural History has just opened an exhibit on warm velvety Muppet sex. It's opened an exhibit on not believing in giraffes. And it's just opened an exhibit on out of this world basanga. I don't know. Not believing in giraffes is pretty funny in its own weird way. I do not believe in Ah, bazongas. Yeah, I finally won one. He's up all night for good fun. I'm up all night for blank. <laughs> Look at that one. He's up all night for good fun. I'm up all night for catastrophe. <laughs> Catastrophic urethral trauma. <laughs> I'm up all night for demonic possession. I'm up all night for a horrifying laser hair removal accident. Tonight on History Channel. <laughs> oh, God. That's horrible. <laughs> and the same as choices to my uh, position. <laughs> and it was horrifying laser hair removal accidents caused by demonic possession and catastrophic urethral trauma. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Or the demonic possession can cause a horrifying laser hair removal accident and then resulted in catastrophic urethral trauma as well. Because <laughs> it depends on where they're removing the hair from. <laughs> <laughs> Your pick. Go for it. <laughs> and he tries sitting there thinking, damn, this one's a tough one too. <laughs> Yeah! The one I didn't think would win! I know, right? The other two were actually really good, too, but... How am I compensating for my tiny penis? Oh. Well... Uh... Hmm... Oh, that sounds good. <laughs> That's not bad. Alright. <laughs> How am I compensating for my tiny penis? Five dollar footlongs. Sweet, sweet vengeance. And, or Mario Kart rage. Because of the current news. <laughs> With the Jerry thing. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I was saving that just in case I actually came across something that'd be perfect for it, but this seemed to fit well enough, too. <laughs> Come to Dubai, where you can relax in our world-famous spas, experience the nightlife, or simply enjoy Blink by the poolside. Yeah. Ah. Come to Dubai, where you can relax in our world-famous spas, experience the nightlife, or simply enjoy heartwarming orphans by the poolside. Aww. Or, or simply enjoy Vespian gas by the poolside. Or you can enjoy literally eating shit by the poolside. <laughs> mm. You know, gotta go oh, with that one. You do have a tender spot. I'm a, I'm you might a, not end up in hell. This one actually worked good without, you know, like actually made me feel good for playing this game for once. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's, you know. Uh, we even got a good one that I could use that on. Uh, I mean, hey, it worked. And would you like those buffalo wings mild, hot, or blank? Hmm. Well, this one's tough. I don't have much. To... Oh, I did. Oh, you said. Right. And would you like those buffalo wings mild, hot, or a stripey? Would you like those... Buffalo wings, mild, hot, or tapping Sarah Angel. 
And would you like those buffalo wings mild, hot, or a sea of troubles? I mean, you know. Who's Sarah Angel? That one I don't actually know. I'm looking her up. Okay. Don't forget, beginning this week, Casual Friday... Uh, sorry, something came in the chat. Wait. I still don't know who she is. <laughs> oh, is it the same one, really? Oh, okay. It's, um... It's, uh, it's, um... A card from Magic the Gathering. If oh, it's the same okay, one thing okay, okay. uh, I guess I read it slightly wrong, but yeah, okay. And actually, in that case... Yeah, no, I've seen those cards. Yeah, I would totally tap that, too. So, uh, don't forget, beginning this week, Casual Friday will officially become Blank Friday. Hmm. Hmm. All right, well, I'll just throw it. Oh, shit. I should have played that card. I got it at the... I recognized I had it at the end. All right, don't forget, beginning this week, Casual Friday will officially become Passive Aggression Friday. Friday will... Or, uh, yeah, Casual Friday will officially become Jufro's Friday. <laughs> or Casual Friday will officially become Muzzy Friday. I do appreciate the idea of free food, but uh, I, his jambalaya is usually too spicy for me. Well, take it. Some milk or something. Like the last, the last time oh, I had wow. some, two bites. Passive, passive aggression. It was like two bites, and I was, I was shitting all over the place. I covered the toilet. <laughs> How did I lose my virginity? Yep, I'll take that. <laughs> Look naked. Okay. This is being weird. Right. There we go. How did I lose my virginity? <laughs> I am doing keggles right now. <laughs> Revenge fucking? <laughs> or Donald Trump? Um. Anyone of <laughs> Oh. Yep. Voice chat daddy. Okay, that was what it was. Boy, Shet died. Boy, Shet back. Yep, we're good. <laughs> that was weird. Right. Uh, almost Donald Trump. Oh, oh. that would have been great. Mine was Donald Trump. Oh. Because Donald Trump fucks everybody in the ass. <laughs> well, that's true. Oh, crap. Jesus is blank. No, oh, really? That would have been great. What is Jesus to you? <laughs> Jesus is... <laughs> Ted's losing it. <laughs> Andrew's losing it. Jesus is... Casting magic missile at a bullet... <laughs> <laughs> Jesus is... Grammar Nazis who are also regular Nazis. Or Jesus is Batman. Huh. <laughs> I'm going to hurry away for this one. Oh, this man. one's hard. They're good. They're all good. Yeah, he's right. It is a tough choice, man. Mm. Casting magic edible. I mean, because that's so, you know, our nerddom, but... I'm sorry. I, I, I said I'd probably go with it almost every time, and I gotta that's go Batman. I played it. I, I gotta do Batman. It, it actually but works. I, That's the problem. But I played a good one. <laughs> oh, no, yours was good too. Jesus is Batman. I'm Batman. I'm Jesus. I'm Batman. And Je what am I? When I pooped, what came out of my butt? Anything like me? That card would be perfect. Uh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Well, I'll just do this one. Just... Okay, when I pooped, what came out of my butt? A live studio audience, shaft, or insatiable bloodlust. Uh, 
Nice. <laughs> what would Grandma find disturbing yet oddly charming? <laughs> mm. uh, so. The picture your grandmother seen, whatever it is that we're about to read of. Uh, yeah. What would grandma? What would grandma find disturbing yet oddly charming? Oompa Loompas, probably. Filling a man's anus with concrete. Okay. Or the eight gay warlocks who dictate the rules of fashion. <laughs> I mean, they're all good. Okay. Next from J.K. Rowling, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Blank. This one. Next from J.K. Rowling, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Altar Boys. Harry Potter and the Chamber of the Mixing of the Races. <laughs> or Harry Potter and the Chamber of the Placenta. <laughs> This here is what we call a close race, boys. Damn. One away from winning. The placenta was close. That was mine. I had nothing good. <coughs> the boats are in, and the new high school mascot is... Oh, come on. That would have been perfect. No. The votes are in, and the new high school mascot is a cartoon camel enjoying the smooth, refreshing taste of a cigarette. <laughs> the new high school mascot is dropping a chandelier on your enemies and riding the rope up. Uh, or the new high school mascot is a magic hippie love cloud. How much LSD do they take? <sighs> That's one. <laughs> That'll be that one. <laughs> Because that's relevant to me. <laughs> and how many kids won't even know what that is? Oh, right. Oh, yeah, nobody. Like, I get it. We all probably get it. Younger viewers won't get it. <laughs> In return for my soul, the devil promised me blank, but all I got was blank. Yeah, well, that could work. Do that and <laughs> that. <laughs> In return for my soul, the devil promised me the euphoric rush of strangling a drifter, but all I got was black people. <laughs> the devil promised me ancient Athenian boy fucking, <laughs> <laughs> but all I got was coughing into a vagina. <laughs> The devil promised me a mime having a stroke, but all I got was a moment of silence. <laughs> Which is kind of funny in its own right. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, he had such a great win to win on, too, really. <laughs> I thought the mime having a stroke was a, was a clever one, honestly. It was. I, knew, I thought mine was way wrong, but... It got worse, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yours was good. They were all good. Yeah. 